Hey, Rob King at Heavyweight Training Center here. I'm going to give you a really good tip on how to improve your bench press, your strength exercises, anything like that if you have one side dominant or one side weak. Just bench pressing here a second ago, and when he was doing it, you could kind of see that one side was kind of like a lot stronger than the other. So instead of trying to work on your strength and bring up the strength while doing bench press, the best way to do it is switch over and do some dumbbells. So what I'm going to do is we're going to do a dumbbell bench press, but you're going to start with your weak side first, okay? You always want to bring up any asymmetries in strength by working your weak side first and not letting your strong side exceed your weak side. So what I'm going to do is you're going to do a dumbbell bench press. In this position, his left arm is the weak arm, so he's going to do left first. Whatever he would fail at, say if it's eight reps hypothetically, you're not going to let the strong side, which is the right side, exceed that, okay? Because otherwise you're just going to make those imbalances even worse. So I'll show you how it goes. Go ahead. Good. Good. So left side is weak. I'm going to isolate that side, bring up that strength as much as possible. Good. Again, a couple more. Start and fail now. Okay, good. Cap it there. How many reps do you have? Seven. Seven? Go seven on this one. Go. Good. Up fast. Lock. Good. Right. Fast. Good. Up strong. Good. Good. Five. Good. Six. Good. Seven. Good. 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 Perfect. So you can see even then at the end, his right set, even after doing seven reps of this arm, which is still taxing on the body, went to his right arm and it was still off the strength there. So what you want to do is work the weak side first, bring up that imbalance, and that's the best way to do it is do dumbbell bench press. Cheers.